Hi, it's Paula here from Dove Audio and I'm here today to talk about our new oscillator, the Wave Plane Oscillator. What do I mean by Wave Plane Oscillator? Well, basically we have an oscillator which has four waveforms generated simultaneously. We have top left, bottom left, bottom right and top right. And then you can use these controls to morph between the waveforms. So let's get some sound on. So at the moment what you're hearing is the waveform from the top left, which is a sawtooth and we can morph across smoothly to the waveform at the top right and then down to the bottom right across to the bottom left now and of course I can go anywhere in between that I wish now of course with it being modulated it wouldn't be much fun without CVs so here's an LFO and I just plop it into X and we can see it start moving across the X and you can hear the waveform changing the next trick we plug another one in and we plug it into the Y we have a waveform that changes around all the four waveforms at the same time. So it gives you this really rich, evolving tone. Now more than this, we can do something else that's really cool with the oscillator. I unplug these two for the moment and go back down to the bottom left waveform. I can take another LFO, here's an orange one, pop it into the bottom left wave. So each corner waveform has its own wavetable as well, it's completely independent. So if I go across to the bottom right you'll notice nothing's happening there. Until I plug in another LFO into the bottom right. So if you combine this with the X and the Y as we did before, into the X, into the Y, And it wouldn't be complete without adding two more LFOs. So here's another one in the top left, another one into the top right. And as you can hear, what this lets you do is create a massively complex waveform with constantly evolving wave shapes. Everything runs at audio rate. So again, if I want, I can bring the LFO for the X and the Y up, Let's take it up into audio. and I can do the same with the, any of the LFOs. So you can create some complete mayhem or you can have these beautifully slow evolving waveforms. Like this. So other features of the oscillator are the same with our WTF oscillator. You have an FM amount, a uh, course amount, which can be set to octaves, as I've got it set now, or you can take a jumper off the back and you can have it as a smooth one. And you've got a fine control, which is about an octave either way. Each wave input has a dedicated CV amount knob, you can see underneath. So there really is a lot going on here, and you can do quite a lot with it. Now this switch lets you invert the right two waveforms. If I do that. So you can get these sort of dips in the sound as it passes from left to right. If I speed up the LFO a little bit, you'll hear that. Or, if I want, I can invert the bottom two waveforms. So you get that quiet sort of dead space as it goes from top to bottom. Again, useful for creating a sort of rhythmical um, evolving sound. So where are we with the concept? Basically we've got our prototype working here, this is this one, this is the first one and the only one in the world at the moment. And what we need to do is turn this into a production, and for that we need your help. And this is why we're doing a Kickstarter. This will be our second Kickstarter and it will be our last Kickstarter. From here on in we should have enough money to be able to roll out new modules without having to resort to the Kickstarter sort of style of doing things. There will of course be a, an MU version of this module. Um, at the moment that hasn't been designed. I wanted to build this version first, test it, make sure everything was okay. And then I will do the PCB layout and the panel generation for the MU version. So thank you for listening. We have a number of pledges on offer and we would really, really gratefully appreciate your support and help us to launch this product to the market and bring something new in the way of wavetables to the market. Thanks very much for watching.